and she was just towering over me like a swole looking ass colossal titan and she's like oh yeah you'll do just nicely sweet pea you know despite the stereotype of the unfit gamer fitness and gaming actually have a lot more in common than you'd actually think whether you are playing an insufferable amount of Dance Dance Revolution for 4 hours straight, or you're looking for a more motion paced vibe like Just Dance. I actually bought a copy of Just Dance, but once the free premium songs were gone, bro, I, I, I was gone. But one that Nintendo actually did for themselves that really got a lot of gamers moving, especially back in the Wii U era, was actually Wii Fit. Which, I never really did, I actually just went to the gym. I promise you this all makes sense in a minute. Bro, the gym has honestly become my safe space just to relax, get a good pump in, and feel better at the end of each session. So I find myself going quite often. I mean, it's fun, it gets me in shape, and in all honesty, it's where I met a lot of fellow gym goers, especially the 50 year old divorced men who for whatever reason always decide to drop the most random lore about their life stories on me. So anyway, I smacked her ass in rebellion and she decided to smack mine back. And then she was one of the best damn school teachers in the district. Now. Is that not what it means to be alive, young blood? Is it? N no. <laughs> nah, but bro, this is one of the weirdest experiences I've had in a minute. So, at my gym, you'll have your regular locals. The old man who be dropping his life stories, the girl who's always sticking out her GAT for attention, and the roid ranger who takes more pre-workout than the entire gym combined. But, what if I told you there was a monster out there that represented all three of these agents of chaos? And her name was Claudia. You see, Claudia was this huge, jacked female of a bodybuilder who would come into our gym and God help you if you were a man in her vicinity using a machine or weight she had dibs on. You're using my machine. Oh, oh, sorry, my fault. Let me just, uh, I'm using that machine too. Oh, oh then I guess I'll just, I'm using it. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, which machine are you using exactly? All of it. See what I mean? The moment she saw you, you were cooked. So one day, there I was working out just doing my thing and I happened to see Claudia. But I'm like, no worries, it's not like she's gonna bother me. She's way over there and I'm just gonna keep to myself. So then tell me why she stomps over to me and she's like, Hey sweet pea. So I took off my headphones and I'm like, um, y yeah? I need a spot. Bro, on my life, I did not want to do this at all. So I'm like, eh, uh, oh, actually, I was just about to... Perfect. It'll only take a second. Bro, she literally grabs me by my shoulder and ushers me to follow her. I swear, if the genders were reversed- Ah, help! He's existing right beside me! But I wasn't gonna be that lucky. So I get to the bench press and I look at the amount of weight she wants to bench. Bro, 375 pounds including the bar. Like, why would you entrust this to me? I mean, yeah, I'm kind of a big guy, but bro, if I mess up, the next person you're gonna see is God. I'm not even gonna lie to you. So she's like, Here I go, sweet pea. And I'm just there like, Please lift it on your own. Please lift it on your own. Please lift it on your own. Also, stop calling me sweet pea. And the bar gets off the handles. And it goes down. And she miraculously pushes it back up. And she does it three times. At one point, it actually looked like she wasn't going to make it. So I was actually gonna attempt to help her. But she was like, Touch this fucking bar and I'll crush your skull in between my thighs! I- wh whoa Like, wow. Okay, well, like, don't tempt me with a good time, but- But she does it. She then turns around and daps me up with her big sweaty hand and is like, Thanks, sweet pea! And I'm like, uh, no worries. Also, stop calling me sweet pea. But at this point, I assumed it was all over and I would not have to see Claudia again. But bro, lo and behold, next time I went to the gym, whose god of war muscularly ass Kratos looking hand clasped me down on my shoulder? Hey, you sweet pea. N no. <laughs> no. No. No! <laughs> now, I'm gonna be real with you. She didn't exactly look like the Wii Fit trainer. But there is a specific reason why I drew her as one. She was really into something called hot yoga. Yoga. And she actually did get a bunch of guys to actually participate in this. And a lot of dudes didn't even want to do this, but you know, it's just something that they just did. Which I'm gonna assume was generally done out of fear. Now, just find your inner chakra and relax. Uh, I, I don't really know if I can right now. It's kind of hard though. I said find your inner chakra and relax! But overall, I still highly recommend Wii U Fit, even though in all honesty, you could just go for like a walk outside for 30 minutes and basically get the same equivalent amount of exercise. But if you're that determined to find a copy of this game and find a Wii U in 2024, 100% go for it. But with that being said, man, leave a like, subscribe and all that cool jazz. Take care of yourself and have yourself a damn good one. And I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye.